So, whatever Krishna consciousness movement is uh, going forward, it is due to Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu's uh, magnanimous compassion for the poor people suffering in this college. Uh, otherwise, uh, to become Krishna conscious is not very easy job. It's not easy job. So, those who are getting the chance of becoming Krishna conscious by the mercy of Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu, they should not lose the opportunity. It will be suicidal. Uh, don't fall down. Uh, it is very easy. Uh, simply chanting my Hare Krishna mantra, not always twenty-four hours, although Chaitanya Mahaprabhu recommends, Kirtaniya Sada Hari, always chant. Uh, that is the principle. But uh, we cannot do that because we are so much overwhelmed by the influence of Kali. So at least sixteen now. Don't miss this. Uh, don't miss this. What is the difficulty? Sixteen nouns. Uh, at most it will take two hours. You have got twenty-four hours. Uh, uh, you want to sleep all that. Sleep. Uh, ten hours sleep. That is not recommended. Don't sleep more than six hours. Uh, but they want to sleep. They want to sleep twenty-four hours. Uh, that is their desire. Uh, we call it you. But uh, no, then you will be wasting time. Minimize eating, sleeping, making, and defending. When it is need, that is perfection. Because these are bodily necessities. Eating, sleeping, making, defending, that is bodily necessities. But I am not this body. So that realization takes time. Uh, but uh, when we are actually advancing in Krishna consciousness, we must know our duty. Uh, sleeping uh, not more than six hours, uh, at most eight hours. At most, those who cannot control. But not ten hours, twelve hours, fifteen hours, no. <coughs> then what is the use of? Uh, Somebody went to see one advanced devotee, and at nine o'clock he was sleeping, and he is advanced devotee. Huh? Is not that? So <laughs> what is what kind of devotee? Huh? Devotee must rise early in the morning by four o'clock, uh, but five o'clock he must finish his bathing and other things. Then he take to uh, chanting and so on. Twenty-four hours business must be there. Uh, so sleeping is not good. Good. Uh, the Goswamis used to sleep uh, only two hours. Uh, <coughs> I also like at night more. I, I also sleep not more than three hours, but I take sometimes little sleep more. Not like I don't imitate the Goswami. That is not possible. <laughs> but as far as possible. Uh, so everyone should try to avoid. And avoid sleeping means if we eat less, then uh, we'll avoid eating, sleeping. Uh, after eating, there is sleeping. So if we eat more, then more sleep. Uh, if we eat less, then less. Uh, eating, sleeping, uh, mating. And mating should be avoided. Uh, uh, that is a, a great stricture. Sex life should be uh, minimized as far as possible. Uh, therefore, we have got this restriction. No illicit sex. Uh, sex I we don't say that you cannot do. Nobody can do. Therefore, uh, sex life means married life. Uh, a little concession. A, a license. All right. You take this license. Uh, but not illicit sex. Then you will never be able. So eating, sleeping, mating, and defending, and defending we are defending so many ways, but still what is there, and the onslaught of material nature 
your country is defending so nicely. But now the petrol is taken away. You cannot defend. Similarly, everything can be taken away at any, any, any moment. So depend on Krishna for defenses. Avasya rakhi ve Krishna. This is called surrender. Surrender means Krishna says that you surrender unto me. Sarvadharmar paritajya. Let us believe this, that Krishna is asking to surrender. Let me surrender. He must protect me in danger. That is called surrender. Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna, Krishna Krishna, 